What is your thoughts on female rappers and that category of female rappers? What do you make of that at this point? 2018. Mm, elaborate. Like, what do you mean? Okay. The category of female rappers. Do you feel like it's too many female rappers at this point? Do you think it's just the right amount? Maybe not enough. Mm, okay. Well, there is more, like, male rappers than females, so there couldn't be too much, but it's just, like, a lot of females are starting to rap now. Not that I have a problem with it. It's good, but, yeah, it's starting to be a lot. Now, uh, do you think the rise of Cardi B and her popularity in 2017 had something to do with that rise or no? Um, no. Don't no. think it was that? I don't think so. What do you think it is? Any way to pinpoint it? Why? It's not even just females, though. Everybody is starting to rap now. Like, it's not even just the females. But mm, I don't even know what I think it is, really. But Cardi B, it's like, I couldn't really say Cardi B st like, is making females want to rap more because there's been other female rappers like that's doing what she did. Well, not really doing what she did, but same stuff. So. I see. Now, you, you did say it is a lot of people rapping now, period. Mm -hmm. uh, in your case, did somebody put the battery in your back to rap, or is this something that you truly wanted to do? I mean, now I want to do it, but at first, all my people I hung out with, like Splurge, Molly, everybody rap. Like, everybody I hung out with rap. So I would just be in the studio, just dry sitting there, like not doing nothing. This is about like, a year and a half ago. Okay. Like, I did not rap. They were telling me, like, rap, like, just do something. I thought they were playing with me. I was like, like, what do I look like? Like, nah. And then one day, me and Molly, we just made a song. And then after that, I just started making music. This song that you did with Molly, did you write your own raps? Did somebody write it for you and you just kind of spit what they wrote? Oh, we didn't write it. We was just, um, we was at Jefferson Studio, Be By Jeff, and... We just punched in back and forth. Like freestyle punching type of mm -hmm. thing. Now, let me ask you this, okay? Uh, something that I noticed with female rappers that I haven't noticed until recently, and when I say recently, I'm talking last year, two years, three years. Female rappers toting guns in their music videos. Mm -hmm. What do you make of that? It's gang shit. Like, I fuck with it. You do? Mm -hmm. Now, just curious. Um, when it comes to female rappers doing stuff like that, what is the percentage of females really living like that? Living, really coming from that environment doing this stuff? 5%. 5%? <laughs> no, nah, probably like 20%. Nah, 5%. Five. 5% five. Five really come from it, and then 95% is just like entertainment, it's a prop. Okay, um, let me see. I'm just gonna explain it. Like, for me, it's like being around like people that really do stuff like like really like the hood like niggas really all that so not so far as i just go around like killing people and shooting people and stuff but i got niggas that do that like mm. i see now uh do other and from your perspective as a female do other women like seeing stuff like this do other guys like seeing stuff like this? Yes, I think females and guys like doing it. I mean, like... Seeing it? Yeah. Because whenever I meet some females, they'll be like, ooh, like, especially, like, women that be a little bit older, they'll be like, you made me want to go shoot somebody or you made me just want to, like, turn up. Like, I guess they like it. Now, what about sex appeal? Okay, female rappers and sex appeal. There's some female rappers that show a lot of their body, mm -hmm. show a lot of their skin, a lot of seductiveness. Then there's some female rappers that play the middle, show a little here, don't show stuff here. Then there's some female rappers that really don't get into it. Mm -hmm. uh, where do you fall on that spectrum? Uh, probably in the middle. I mean, I keep it like, I mean, I be thugging like sweats, shoes. Shirts, but sometimes I like to look cute, post a little picture on Instagram. I don't really like go out like that, but. Has anyone ever higher up, and when I say higher up, I mean like uh, 
record label exec, A and R, mm -hmm. uh, manager, consultant, advisor, whatever. Has anyone ever asked you to show more than what you already show? No. Just curious. Is there a pressure to show more than what you already show? Mm -mm. I just think, I don't know. It's just me. Like, I guess everybody already knows, like, this is how I always dress, like, not too, not tomboyish, but not girly -ish. It's just regular. Mm, I see. Uh, just curious. Mm -hmm. Do you think you would be farther ahead of your career if you did show more than what you show now? Mm, probably. Probably I'd get more like male followers on Instagram. They'd probably boost me. Probably watch my stuff more. Just curious. Um, now, is it important? Is sex appeal important for a female rapper? No. I, not important. Sex appeal is not important. I mean, if you rap about sex, <laughs> then probably like, but as far as like rapping about guns and killing people, like, what do you need to wear a bra and skirt for? Like, it don't matter.